Okay, you guys. So I have been texting just a phone number, right? I know I'm in my pajamas and I look like crazy, but that, don't worry about that. <laughs> I have been texting just a phone number and back and forth, back and forth for days. And this customer friend fan kept telling me, I have a package I'm sending you. I already sent it and it was the wrong address. And I was like, oh gosh, you know, how am I gonna figure this out? It was kind of a nightmare. Um, there's a new fan mail address that I can get, but the old one is not valid right now during COVID-19. So we went back and forth and here in my head, I'm thinking this could be fake, okay? No offense, but I mean, truly, someone could have me running around town and this is just a joke. So I still ran around town looking for this package, couldn't find it, got it pushed away. I, I know my UPS guy's phone numbers. I know all of them, right? My guys. And they're so helpful. Well, I did have to call the 1-800 number. I got it moved around. And then I got to my location and I picked up a package. And I was, she goes, yeah, I just got here, this and that. And I was like, okay, great. So I get home and I am very grateful for this, this gift as well. I got some face masks that were handmade by a friend, family, fan, <laughs> YouTube fan. And I was like, the text message person, right? Because I'm getting a lot of texts. Okay, I get a lot of texts. And if you don't get a response, it's probably because I'm super overwhelmed. But the text message woman or person, I, at this point, I don't know who it is, right? I just know that this person has sent a package and I'm running around looking for it. And I picked a package up thinking, I got it. And I let her know, I got it. So I wrote her that night and I said, you said it was fragile. I got some face masks and it kicked back. So it didn't send. And so the next day I got, I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm not thinking about it. And a few days pass. And then I get another text from that same number. Now I've deleted it because now I'm just like, okay, I don't even know that this is really real. So I delete it. And a few days later I get a text. Hey, did you get the package? And I said, no, I ran around all over the place. I got a package. Or I said, I got a package. I didn't get anything fragile. Did you send face mask? She goes, no, I didn't. I said, okay, I didn't get that package. And she goes, no, it said you picked it up. And, um, I'm just going to hope that you have it. And I said, no, I honestly, no, I did not pick anything fragile up. Right. Because she kept saying, I hope it's okay. It's fragile. I'm thinking UPS is not really that great. They throw things around. So we're crossing our fingers. I don't know. But in the same time, I'm just randomly texting this phone number. I don't know a name. I don't even know nothing about nothing. You can't assume if you text somebody, they have your number saved. If you don't talk to them all the time, no offense. So then today I called my people and they said, yes, we have a package and it was messed up. And they got in an argument with the lady. The lady had called them and said, don't you guys have a package? Oh yeah, it was picked up. And she's like, no, you need, you know, anyway, I told them, I said, she, they told me, call your, your fan and let her know. I said, no, you call your, the fan. I said, you're the one that was rude. You know, you're the one that told her the package wasn't there, this and that. So you have to go fix that. And she ain't going to believe me, in my opinion. I'm like, no, I'm not going to go. I, let her really know. I didn't get a package, right? I'm pretty honest, but I like people to believe the honesty by going through the action of hearing, seeing, and viewing. And someone else saying, oh, she didn't really pick up the package. We messed up. Because then it'd be like, well, Dee Dee picked up the package. She was trying to hide it from me. No, 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 no. That's not going to be me, okay? But I, I know now it was clear. So then I get the package and I'm trying to do this 24 hour quarantine, but I'm pretty excited about the package. I mean, cause it's actually real. And at some point I finally said, what is your name? So I can see the package name is actually the right package, right? So she tells me her name. And if, if you can imagine, I do talk to a lot of people. I talk, text, message. I mean, it comes across all avenues and it's overwhelming for one person. If you can just imagine that just imagine it just a little so I ask for your patience and some people do not have patience with me I ask for your patience when you want a response when you need something because there might be one groomer you're writing but I'm writing thousands of fans or clients or potential clients or shoppers or whatever and each one of y'all are really important to me but because there's only one DD I know I'm hearing it hire people right Right now, during COVID-19, you want me to hire someone? I kind of want to, 
but I can't right now. Everything is shut down. So I have got to take this and just bear with it until we get a level of normalcy. And normal isn't the same normal it used to be. So we need to get wait till we get a level of understanding of this disease and then we can see what we have left. But we all have to pay our bills. So I get it. You just got to be patient. I get this I get this beautiful box and I open it up and I'm like, "Oh, I got to take a picture." So I went and I took a I got my little picture. I got my little look how cute it came. And like literally my packages don't look that beautiful and I was like, "Oh, that is so pretty. I have to take a picture." So I took a picture. And then I got this card. Whoop. This card and it's actually for my birthday. And this would have been perfect the other day when I got it. It was my birthday. I drove out there on my birthday to try to get it and it didn't work out. This would have been perfect, but it is perfect now. Happy birthday, it says here at the bottom. Here it says, wishing you a memorable birthday. Didi, during this 2020 quarantine, thank you, thank you, thank you for serving our country and for sharing your wisdom of business. Thank you for teaching me so many grooming tricks and having the right supplies available. Thank you for all you've done during this COVID-19 crisis, including making it possible for the military to get masks. I appreciate you and I'm very proud of you. As Bailey, remember, she's my daughter with special needs that talks to you on the TV. Bailey, what's up Bailey? Bailey, woo! <laughs> and I have been binge watching your old videos I came across one where you were sitting by the door in your shop telling this woman with a white dog to about your to about your dog that had died and the and the butterfly that shows up that showed up. Let me tell you, that butterfly visited me today too, girl. Today. This is so perfect. Today. Is it May 7th? I'm so lost to May 7th, 2020. Anyways, it is Thursday. May something, 2020. <laughs> May Right after my birthday, May 7th, I think. The butterfly visits me often. And I will tell you the butterfly story one day. It will be surreal. She continues to say, telling the woman with a white dog about your dog that had died and the butterfly that showed up. I was in tears during this heart moving moment. What a blessing you are. God is using you for great things and I'm so pleased you get that. I love the PJ prayers. Well, when I saw this gift, I knew it was, it was for you. Thank you so much for all you do and happy birthday. God bless, Miss Grace. Grace B, thank you so much. Thank you for bearing with those random, weird looking, crazy, I don't even know how they sound, text messages where I'm overwhelmingly driving around trying to do this all at the same time and still have my birthday party, my pool party. I wanted to decide, I wanted to open it up live because it's so um, pretty and uh Fragile, she said, so I better be really careful here. I'm pretty excited. So I'm opening it up. Oh, I'm getting excited. A pink rubber band. Okay, we don't want to drop it. Oh. Oh, look. Oh, gosh, look. Look. Look how beautiful it is. Now, Miss Grace, you just done gone beyond yourself. <laughs> Thank you so much. I just gotta show you something else. Okay, hold on, bear with me here. Look who's watching me right now. You staring at mommy. You staring at mommy, yeah. Are you staring at mommy? I just love you too. I love you, Saki. Yes, I do. I love you, Saki. Now, Saki will 
just stare at me and in amazement and love that is so deeply unconditional. And as I'm opening this stuff, she's happy for me and staring at me and with love. Grace, look. YouTube, look. Gosh, man, what am I doing? Gorgeous. It's got a, a okay, 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 work with me here. Can I get a production? Look, look, I'll turn it around. Look how beautiful this is. It's just doing an echo back. Oh, oh it just brought tears to my eyes. Look at this. Just beautiful. Grace, it just brought tears to my eyes. And I'll take the rest of the cry solo on my own in my private time. Sometimes little things that we do, just like communicating with you in a video that you may receive so much from, and you may have binge watching me. I don't know if I deliver to every single person who watches the message that is intended. I don't know if I get them to be upset, sad, mad, happy. I just hope I do my best at what I'm meant to be doing. And I hope you find value in that and in my time and in the freeness of it all. Because so much of it is out there just for you to watch for free. Along the way, you'll meet friends and fans and people that add value to your life and become close to you. And some folks, you're not going to let go. And some folks come just along for a moment of the journey. But Grace, thank you for your friendship. Thank you for letting me know I make a difference in your child's life, your disabled child. Thank you for being a friend. And thank you for your gift. God bless you. And know that you mean so much to me. Thank you so much. All right. I'll talk to you later. I got to close out. And just watch this. Do, 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 do. Sucky, I love you. Say I love you, baby. I love you, baby. Thank you so much. We'll talk to you later.